Holy damn, it's raining like a son of a bitch outside. I find a lot of goofy games, as you know, through the time of this channel, but what about one where Princess Peach is a big fat fucking bitch? Well, today's review is Super Mario Bros. 2, but Peach is fat. That was created by that one guy from DeviantArt. No, seriously, that is his fucking name. The game was released on itch.io, so you can download the game. I will put it in the description box below where you can get it. It was released this year. Basically, it's similar to Super Mario Bros. 2. That one guy from DeviantArt made changes to the Peach sprite and movement. Spill the Beans recreated the game on Scratch, which if you don't know what Scratch is, it's used for coding and has a simple visual interface that allows mostly kids to create digital stories, games, animations, and so on. Scratch is developed, designed, and moderated by the Scratch Foundation, although some people use it to make games like this. Apparently it's free as well. Pixel Cat made the original Fat Peach Sprite, which is fucking hilarious. Not only that, you can play as Mario, Luigi, and Toad, just like in the original. So the little backstory on this game goes like this. Princess Peach has eaten too much cake. Now you might be thinking, oh come on, she might be a little curvy. Fuck no. More like obese Kirby. She can barely move, she's slow, can barely jump as high as she used to, and so on. But basically you just have to go through, take down shy guys and all them motherfuckers, and basically you're not getting much done as Princess Peach. You might as well play as Mario, Toad, or Luigi. Now you know that little slot machine minigame? Well when you collect coins in the game, by going into the dark world, you will do that minigame here as well and you can gain extra lives. Which is always nice, especially if you're just gonna play this game is Princess Peach. Not only are you gaining extra lives, but you're probably gaining extra pounds, too. The graphics for Super Mario Bros. 2, but Peach is fat. Not bad. There is some issues with glitching. There are some bugs here and there, even graphically. The sprites are very similar, but it's actually pretty hilarious. The level designs are similar. The game looks nice. The music and sound effects are basically the same from Super Mario Bros. 2 on the NES, and I fucking love the music in that game. Some of the best music in the Super Mario Bros. series, period. The controls could use a little work. Left and right arrow keys are to move. Up is to jump. If you play as Peach, you can float. Barely. Fat bitch. Down arrow is to crouch hold for a super jump and press up to jump higher than before spaces to pluck up items as well as enemies open doors and of course pick up orbs it's playable but definitely needs some work like i said earlier you probably don't want to play as princess peach unless you just want to have her walk around and you can stare at her fucking oversized ass super mario brothers 2 but peach is fat is a pretty funny game not the most amazing fan game i've ever played but it is playable i really hope the glitches are worked out and so on then i think it would be better maybe a different program other than scratch something like game made or even make a ROM out of it. I'm sure that can be done because you remember there was that Sonic 2XL ROM hack where Sonic collects rings and becomes a fat fuck. But for what it is, it's not bad. A bit of a pain in the ass with the hit detection and how easy it is for you to die, but I think this is more made for a meme and it is funny. But the good thing is you can download the game right now on itch.io and try it out for yourself. Now there is no other games from that one guy from DeviantArt, although on his page he does have a link to his DeviantArt and he says he makes not safe for work content. So that could be a little weird, but I stay away from deviant art because there's a lot of fucking weirdos on there. Well, that is it for this review of Super Mario Brothers 2, but Peach is fat. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.